Here you go, just like that. Put them in. It's going to fill up. Let's see what we got. What is up, Raw Fam, and welcome back to the craziest, you know, coolest, most epic channel on YouTube. As you guys can see, we are over here at my beautiful, epic little baby koi pond. This is actually a koi pond that I put baby, beautiful, little $5 koi, and I actually grow them to be mega monsters. So, of course, that's my little koi molly goldfish army. Those guys are so cute, they're so beautiful, but guys, we need one more fish to add to this beautiful little collection. So obviously, if you guys know me, you guys know I can make a fish trap out of almost anything. So of course, I have a buddy, and my buddy's name is Monster Mike. A couple days ago, he went off, and he built a Lego fish trap, which actually inspired me. And yet again, I'm just so excited to go off, build a Lego fish trap, and of course, catch something absolutely epic inside of that trap. Whoa, what is up, Raw fam? So now we are over here at Walmart, of course, and we are here in the Lego section. Now, guys, they have these Legos right here that are a little bit too small. I could get the little bit thicker of Legos. You know, I think these are the ones we need. Of course, these are the Legos that we're actually gonna be going with. These things get a little bit bigger than your average Lego. You know, these are, I think, a little bit better um, for our purposes of, you know, making a fish trap today. Um, a couple more things we're gonna need to get. We're gonna need to get some, let's see. They have these like little Lego things. <gasps> There you go. We have a little glue gun right here, David. And of course, we're gonna need some glue for the glue gun, of course. Fam, yet again. All right, Raw Fam, so now we are actually back at the Raw Fam household. This is my garage right behind us, but you know, today we're gonna be building a Lego fish trap, of course. I'm actually gonna be opening up this little Lego kit. Um, yeah, as you guys can see right here, these are all of the different little Legos you can get. You know, let me see. If I could, you know, I don't think we need this anymore. Um, this is like my little Lego kit. Let me see. Oh, look, there we go. So, uh, should we make it a car? Should it be like a Lego car fish trap? I don't know. Um, there's like wheels and stuff. We get all of these cool little pieces. So as you guys can see, if you guys look down, we're gonna have to unravel all of these little Legos. So, let's do it. Damn. All right, guys, so as you guys can see, we have the Legos right here. Now, if I open this little Lego kit up, oh, oh, there we go. Now, what I'm gonna do is take this duct tape, and I'm actually going to make a big, long strand, and I'm gonna lay it perfectly alongside of this little, um, this little edge right here. Basically, what it is gonna do, it's going to allow me to know where I have to cut to make a perfect box. Take this. Here you go, just like that. Put that there. Okay, so there you guys go. So as you guys can see, you know, I have this little bit of duct tape, so now I could actually get rid of these little Legos. You know, I don't need them here now. I have to cut along that little duct tape, you know, so I actually have a perfect little box. Perfect. Okay, so that's one side, and then now we could do And that should be the last one. So this is actually gonna be the bottom of our fish trap. Now guys, if you guys look right here, this is actually the Lego side, but this is not gonna fit this type of, wait, it is gonna fit? Oh, <gasps> it just, it just fit. Wait, what? Okay, I, I stand cor, wait, do it again. It just, it just fit. Okay, hold up. So I honestly thought it wasn't gonna fit. Let me see this. Oh, oh my God, bro, it, it, it's actually fitting. It fit! I didn't think that th they were the same type of Lego. See how big these holes are and see how small those? I did not think that this big Lego was gonna actually fit to that. So what I could do, put hot glue, put hot glue, because this is gonna be like the most important part. So you see that, bro? That's gonna be the little hole so all the fish could actually swim into here. Ready? Are you listening? Damn. Uh. Yeah. Uh. 
Ow! All right, Rob Fib, so now it is officially the next day. We have my little Lego fish trap. As you guys can see, there is a little door. Um, so whenever your cichlids, you know, they want to close their door at the end of the night, you know, they can do that so no strangers get inside of their little home. As you guys can see, you know, this is the front of the fish trap. You know, I'm going to show you every single side. So guys, get a very good look at, you know, this little fish trap. Um, there's another door on this side. Everybody wants a back door on their house, of course. So as you guys can see, you know, this is the other side. Um, as you can see on the top, we have these little flaps. You could actually pull those back. I don't really want to pull them back yet um, to get your catch. Whatever you catch, you can pull it back, pull it out. And of course, this is our Lego fish trap. This is where we're going to be putting the Lego fish trap inside of the water right now, of course. But before we put this thing in, we have to, you know, bait the fish trap. So come down here. Let's go all the way down here. Okay, so. Uh, so as you guys can see, there is this little opening right here. And what we're gonna do is just put our little pebbles inside of there, you see that? No, just, just put them in, okay? Now we close it right there, and if we have a fish in here, we could just peel these back, you see that? And we could actually get that fish out. Um, that's actually a pretty good um, plan on how we're gonna get those fish, so of course, Let's open up the little trap, okay? Both of the doors are officially opened, as you can see. So let me get up close and personal. So basically, what happens is you put the bait inside of here. They smell it. All these fish, you know, basically smell it. It gives off like a little mist. These fish from over here, they smell it. They see, yo, where the heck is it? Follow the mist back. Go inside of the trap, and of course, we got them. Rafa, did we take a dub or an L on this fish trap? Of course, guys, there's a pull right there. Guys, what do you guys think? Pretty cool, huh? So I'm gonna open this baby up right there. You guys ready? So as you guys can see, we have our little Lego fish trap right here. It is officially time to put this baby inside of the water. Yet again, I'm not too sure if this guy will float. So we have a rock to go right on top. There you go. So you guys ready? There is a lot of cichlids. There's a lot of green tilapia, blue tilapia, um, there's a ton of bluegill, largemouth bass, there's even a couple um, snakeheads in here because there's a little bit of canals and stuff, um, which this is my secret snakehead spot, so don't tell anybody. We're gonna take this little Lego fish trap, come right here, see how it would look inside the water. So basically, it's going to fill up right there. You know, that's my little Lego fish trap right there. Good? Mm -hmm. Holy crap, look, 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 see that? Is that a snakehead right there? Can you zoom, can you zoom? Bro, you gotta zoom, you gotta zoom. It's going, it's almost gone. Did you see what it was? Bro, is that a snakehead? Oh my God, did you see that? Did you see, bro, that was so sick. So of course we came back this way a little bit. We tested out the trap over there. I think it was a little too shallow. Um, we're gonna try it right here though. And we got a bigger rock than before. Uh. There we go. Oh, no, 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 no. That was a problem we were having too. Okay, hold up. All right, right here. Okay, perfect. So it, it just has to have a, a flat bottom. Okay, that's like the, the key to this trap. Um, if there is a flat bottom. So I think one of the keys to this trap is that you find a flat bottom, as you guys can see right there. Look, that is actually our little Lego fish trap right there. I mean, I think it's gonna work, guys. Comment down below. Do you guys think this Lego fish trap is going to work? Um, all I know is is that we have to get out of here because if you see right here, see those weeds? The more you guys get inside those weeds and you push them around, these little cichlids, tilapia, bluegill, anything that's in there will actually get scared and you know they, they won't come out of the weeds. So let's back up, guys. Um, guys, just push it that way. Raw fam, guys, I think the trap is going to work. You know, hopefully, you know, all the fish that are inside of these weeds right here smell the bait that we gave off. You could see the trap right there. You could barely see it, you know? You wanna zoom in right there? You know, see if you could see the trap way over there. You could already see minnows on. Look, 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 look. Zoom, zoom, zoom. 
That is just one little baby pellet, guys. And guys, honestly, there is like a hundred baby little pellets inside of the trap itself. So imagine how many fish we're gonna be able to catch. You know, that's one little pellet out there. Imagine how many fish we're gonna catch inside of the trap. I mean, this is so epic. But of course, guys, these fish are actually coming out of the weeds right now. Um, I don't want to scare them. I want to back up so me and my buddy David What's have up, the best opportunity to catch something crazy. So I love you all, fam. Let's just back up, okay? Wait, show me. Is that a fancy guppy right there? It actually does look like one, right? You guys see the fancy guppy? So oh my, bro, that is so sick. Guys, we're all fam. Guys, do you guys want us to, you know, to come back and try and catch that little guy? You know, we could even go to the pet store get a bunch of fancy guppies and bring them back here and like eventually catch them when they They'll start breed. breeding. Be all over this place, yeah. That'd be so sick guys. I have to go check my FWC laws to see if that's legal, but of course we're all fam. We're waiting for this fish trap to be epic, to be crazy, to be psycho. And hopefully we get it done. So I love you all fam. Let's do it. Put it back in. Hurry bro. David, put it back in bro. You're going to miss them. Close it. Push down, push down. Hey, bro, go get them. Go get them. See them all. Hurry, yeah. hurry, hurry. Let me see what you got. Let me see. Hurry, bring it, bring it here. Oh yeah, you got them, bro. Look, look, look. You guys see that? Those are a bunch Those of beautiful little ones. minnows. Here you go. Empty out your net. Is there any more inside the net? No? No. All right, with the camera. I got some. David, what I get? Hold the hold the net there so the camera can see. There we More go. Big see that? Guys, see that? That's so cool. Throw them in. All right, bro. We actually got to go check the trap soon. So hurry up. Let's get one or two more scoops and then go check the trap. All right. Dang it. All right, we're gonna have to switch up our strategy because all of the minnows, because it just started blowing, are out inside of the middle of this little pond. Um, we did get a lot of beautiful little minnows. Hold up, guys. Come here. Uh, we have. All of these little guys. Look at these guys. Oh my god, hold up, back up, back up. Let me show you guys. Look at this, bro. Look at this beautiful little feeder minnow. I bet Jaws would eat that little guy. He's so freaking cute. He's so cool. But of course, guys, I think it is officially time. We have to go check our traps, okay? So um, there's a guy mowing his lawn right here, so I'm sorry about the noise, but let's actually run over there and see if you know we got anything. So let's do it. Um, just ready. You gotta hurry, guys. There's there's so much stuff happening, and it's so noisy that I just want to do this as quick as possible for you guys, so you guys don't have to hear all this annoying noise. So come here. As you guys can see, the trap is still there. It is still doing awesome. Hold up, hold up, hold up right here. You ready? Okay. 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 Let me. Okay, I just closed the doors. Oh, wait, you hear that? You hear that? Listen. You hear it? There was stuff moving. There was stuff moving. There, I, I swear to God, I just heard stuff moving. Come here. Okay. Let me put my shirt down. Sorry, guys. I swear I just heard stuff moving. Okay, here you go. As you guys can see, if I look in here, I can't. Can you guys see in there? Can you guys get a good look? Can you guys see? Mm -mm. Oh, you guys can't? Okay, so let me see. Um, try the other side because it's maybe the blue. It will be the difference. Can you see in there? No? Okay, we'll, we'll back up then. Okay, so um, it, just in case if this actually happened, I, I put a little hole on top. So I could look, just come right here. I could bend this little plastic out, okay? And I could bend it up right there. Let me just put my hand in there. Oh, jeez. Okay, what did I get? Let me, come here. Jeez, it's so slippery. Oh, oh, look at this. Bro, look at that. It's a little green tilapia, bro. Okay, wait, hold. pop, 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 pop. Um, let me put this guy inside of the bucket right here. Okay, see that? Okay, so that is a little bait. Guys, guys, that is a bait for Jaws. But I, I saw something else in here. Come here, guys. Come. So let me see if I can get my hand in here. You ready? Where is he? Let me see. Oh, there's a minnow. And, oh, okay, I got him. I got him. Let's see what we got. Oh, my God. 
Look how gorgeous that thing is. What is it? Oh my gosh. Look at these little dots. Oh my gosh. Look at this thing. That is the prettiest fish I've ever caught out of a canal. Oh my gosh. Bro, in a Lego trap? Bro, look at this. Oh my gosh. Bro, that is just the most prettiest thing ever. Guys, that literally looks like a like a piece of candy. It literally, it looks fake. Wait, back up, back up. Oh my gosh. Guys, comment down below. What is this thing? I, we have these Oh, it's a Midas. That's what it has to be, right? I, I think it's a Midas. Okay, we're going to put this guy in there. A beautiful little Midas. Guys, we did it. Oh my We freaking with this piece of crap. Oh. Oh. No. Well, I was gonna try and redo it again once I saw that gorgeous Midas pop up, but look, this is our trap. It just broke. Oh no. So look, let me let me bring it right here. Come here guys, come here. Let me bring it right here, okay? So then you guys can get a better look so there's nothing in the background. You guys ready? Come, come look. Okay, so guys, I need your guys' help. What is this thing? My opinion, I think it's a Midas. Oh, there's some more cars. I think this guy is a Midas cichlid or tilapia or something like that look at his beautiful little colors and his eyes oh my god his eyes are so gorgeous so i'm gonna put that little guy down there because i need to you know get this guy back to my aquarium asap because that guy is so gorgeous guys guys raw fam some of you guys that have been watching my channel for a long time guys i need you guys to let me know is that the coolest craziest thing i've ever seen it or caught in a fish trap all right raw fam so if you guys make a lego fish trap Ugh. All right, Raw Fam, so as you guys can see, if you guys look in the bucket, we have all of our fish. They're doing amazing, but guys, when you guys catch fish in a fish trap, guys, where, where are you guys going? Wait there for a second. Guys, when you guys catch fish in a fish trap, okay, you guys, you know, and you guys don't have an aerator on these guys, you guys have to be responsible fish keepers and get home as fast as possible so these fish don't run out of oxygen and, and die. Oh, as you guys can see, we are back at the Raw Fam household. We have my beautiful little fishies inside of here. But guys, now it is officially time to take these beautiful little fish and put them in their new home. So after me. Bro, should we name him Bubba? I accidentally called him that, but he's so gorgeous. Look at him. Oh my gosh, Raw Fam, guys. Guys, I need you guys to look at him. See him? Guys, look at those colors right there, guys. This thing is so gorgeous. Welcome to your new home. Oh, there he goes! Oh, man, there he goes! Oh, that was so cool, guys. Now, oh my god, we're gonna have to go back and see if we can catch another one. I mean, that thing is gorgeous. Right here, this is a green tilapia. Guys, Jaws is about to devour this, so you ready? Come here. Come here, Jaws. Come here. Ready? This is my peace tree with Jaws. Oh! 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 It hurt so bad, but it felt so good. Oh. All right, Raw Fam, so that is gonna be the end of today's awesome, crazy adventure. Guys, that was a Lego fish trap, and we caught literally one of the coolest fish I've ever caught, ever. I think it was a Midas tilapia cichlid. I don't know, look at that red tail, look at the red tail. Oh my gosh, bro, he's so big, pull it back, pull it back. Well fam, so that is gonna be the end of today's awesome, crazy adventure. If you guys like massive fish, like that red tail, guys, you guys gotta subscribe down low. Guys, we are launching some of the craziest, coolest stuff ever on the Raw Fam website. So there's a link in the description. I love you all fam, and I will see you guys in the next awesome, crazy adventure for more awesome stuff like this. Hey, Charles, uh, come here, come here, come on. Yeah, I know you. Oh, I love Raw Fam, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.